getting angry it, it is uh, see one is not just children i thought let's discuss let's deal with anger as such it, it is uh, it, in any relationship there is this potential of anger either between a parent and a child between spouses between uh, and uh, and uh, a manager and the subordinate or in a, any of between friends as well there could be anger the question is one is there are quarrels there is anger and when you try to advise them the anger multiplies especially there are times you know when you try to advise them the, if the children means they will tell the pa- parents can you please zip up either they will please zip up or i don't know it is it's okay we know you know we don't need any advice from you some kind of a thing will happen or if it is between husband and a wife you are advising really uh, you think you can advise i know the kind of a uh, uh, so the anger multiplies so let's discuss anger per se anger is basically an expression of helplessness anger is an expression of helplessness the the feeling i am not in control of the situation expresses itself as anger the feeling the thought that i am not in control of the situation manifests as anger anger observe is a result and effect of your inability to deal with the situation anger is nothing but is a signal it's your inability to handle a situation please understand that anger is not born out of the deficiency in others but it is born out of your inadequacy to deal with a situation anger is not a result of deficiency or or an issue with another person but it is your inability to deal with the situation if you are careful you will understand that anger is more a message a signal to you than to the other anger if you are if you are cautious anger you will consider anger as more as a message as a caution to you than than to the other it is uh, you can never become angry without a desire being interrupted period if you are getting angry right now you are getting angry with me or whatever and whatever some desire has to get interrupted without your desire getting interrupted there cannot be an anger some desire is getting interrupted when you ask for a coffee it is not yet come the lecture has started and you know this fellow also asked they asked everybody to put down the camera you can't get up and come uh, suddenly somebody some people will, the camera will be off only the sound will come i know coffee is down they have not yet you know, muted the the mic the the sound is there you know, especially the coffee is nice the sound is little more in the stereophonic anger as i mentioned arises only please make a note you know this will save a lot of time and will bring a lot of anger is a result of some desire interrupted has to be some desire interrupted from ridiculous thing like while taking a shower i know this fellow you know, while taking a shower he is using that you know, the bath soap that falls down he gets angry with the soap idiot when you know, the what happened you know? no no the soap the, the soap soap is supposed to be soapy that's the reason you know? it falls down while taking the shower the desire not to bend and take uh, anger the desire is why should i bend and take therefore they are all there are you know all the companies they get shower gel 
you don't need to bend one press there are some specimen that also falls down so anger anger is a result of some desire interrupt that's why in the next time when you're angry navin kabra is just entering i'm angry why is he coming so late become aware of your anger become aware of your anger the, the only way to reduce anger is becoming aware of your anger if you know that i am i am angry then the next stage is become aware of the futility of anger become aware of the futility of anger you can see in after all the anger you have to do what you have to do it could be coffee where the sugar is less with after all the argument do you think your uh, you know your partner is going to go sorry i think the there was less sugar let me come and uh, you know add some sugar to you know you go after all the argument you have to go get extra spoon of sugar and put it in your thing rather have you know while drinking itself no sugar uh, another if you are aware of the futility of anger you are wearing the what do you call in the the apple watch another 20 steps added on to your walking that's all understand become aware of your anger become aware of the futility of your anger become aware that nobody including you benefits from anger become aware that nobody including you benefits from anger again become aware that everybody including you loses a lot because of anger so the the suggestion is burn anger before it burns you burn anger before it burns you lord buddha used to give various episodes on anger he said anger is like holding a ball of fire in your hand and throwing it down steel king it is uh, i'm having a a ball of fire on my hand and throwing it on steel king the steel steel may melt along with that i the in the process i burn my hands that's right uh, the it is the the only way to deal with anger is to become more aware of it that's why the, the only way, in case you have to deal with anger my guru used to tell me he says at times you may have to deal with anger the the best way to deal is you may have to use your anger at times but never lose your anger you may have to use your anger at times as a just an expression but never lose your anger fascinating friends one in fact many of the relationships falters is because of anger in fact they say in the gita i think in chapter 5 towards the last he says if you can't control anger you cannot be a yogi is in a yogi who is one who has perfect control over their emotions i mean in the, in the present scenario even last week we discussed one a, a, a bhakta's quality one of the 35 qualities is is that he is a yogi con whatever they do whatever they don't do is is designed to unite with the divinity where is that and what is our understanding of yogi a tree pose you if you start doing that one leg pose you are a yogi can you imagine or either one one mala you put on i don't know what all they do a yogi a bhakt a yogi is one all their actions thoughts thoughts emotions actions are designed to unite with the divinity that is a yogi and lord krishna in the gita says it is it is it is those who have a perfect control over their emotions especially anger he is a perfect yogi says krishna in chapter 5 so that's why in the dealing with children dealing with uh, adults any aspect friends 
people hurt you because of their immaturity you get hurt because of your immaturity people hurt you because of their immaturity and you get hurt because of your immaturity and you can continue getting hurt and it just heightens or in and enhances your immaturity see christ was he was christ immature in dealing with those who nailed him to the cross was christ immature and the forgiveness was flowing from his personality others hurt him because of their immaturity christ was powerful enough to deal with it or spiritually wise enough to deal with it so to go through it anger is an expression of helplessness the feeling i am not in control of the situation expresses itself as anger anger is a result and effect of your inability to deal with the situation anger is not born out of the deficiency in others but it is born out of your inefficiency to deal with the situation friends this is important anger is more a message to you than to another you always you, know, you go for a morning walk and there is somebody with a with a dog walking and then you do something like this and the dog starts barking at you for the next 10 minutes and somebody tells something to you you are barking for the next 20 minutes what should i call you i don't even want your answer somebody tells you something what happened venu ji you seem to have put on weight see he's laughing or somebody tells karen you have put on weight she'll be very pleased it is uh, somebody tells you something and you you bark for the next 20 minutes what should i call you you going for a walk and somebody you know, it could be and then you do something to the dog and that, that dog is barking 15 minutes one gesture can all can can affect you that's why i say become aware of your anger there has to be some desire which is interrupted become aware of the desire become aware of the futility of your anger become aware that nobody including you benefits from anger become aware that everybody including you gets affected because of your anger please burn anger before it burns you you have no idea as i mentioned in you know, it is we always use that statement speak when you're angry you'll make the greatest speech you'll ever regret speak when you're angry you'll make the greatest speech you'll ever regret anger has caused more damage to relationships than any other emotion so the only suggestion as far as anger is there are two suggestions identify the disruption to an anger to a desire some desire is interrupted therefore there is anger therefore you want to deal with the anger deal with the desire which is interrupted and the second aspect is at times you may have to use your anger but never lose your anger when you lose your anger you, know, you are you've lost yourself you for you to collect yourself take some time you could be in a meeting you've lost your anger with a subordinate you're sitting there 20 minutes you can't focus because you lost your temper you used your temper just as an expression understand look here these reports should be should be on my table by 12 noon tomorrow as an anger is an expression just a, i mean it is a, you're using it and you're in a meeting you're perfectly okay and they say anger creates an acid in your system and any acid which is in a container it 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 uh, destroys the container have you that's a reason friends anyone whose emotions are not right look at their face after a certain time look i mean after a certain years <laughs> and at the same time you look at a person who has all the pure emotions you know that's why in, in sanskrit they call us tejas spiritual lustre there is a person with very less desires is childlike 
there's a smile in the natural smile in their face you need botox and all kinds of treatments if you have anger anger and other things you need enough one more treatments so watch out friends when i saw that question of an anger dealing with children <laughs> it is anger is not just dealing with children when it comes to children what do you expect children <laughs> you did the same thing when at that age if you are very wise at that age and you are such a buddha at that age then something you can talk about you are worse than your children at that age and then na his kids are terrible same thing your parents told about you same thing they told about you in fact little worse they have been refined enough not to expose certain things i remember when my mother used to call me baby bidda bidda means baby once in sari the where is where is the baby Saita said, no, which baby you are talking about? No, my baby. He said, this baby? She said, yeah. So, <laughs> it is interesting. That's why I am saying, therefore, anger. Understand, you get hurt. If you are getting hurt, it is because of your immaturity. Others hurt you because of their immaturity. It is only due to one person's maturity you can deal with others. and in there's a beautiful ways to deal with it one of the phenomenal ways is suggested by a great saint is that so is that so somebody tells you how much we tease uh, arjun reddy poor fellow gets me gets it from me every time and venuji don't know they they have this attitude is that so that is that's the reason they 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 are able to survive with me otherwise <laughs> so it's a anger is more a message to you than to another there is some inability in me there is some desire which is interrupted and it is anger that's when i become aware of the futility of anger please become aware of the futility of anger a few moments of calmness will save years of peace something you tell at a certain stage to a relative or something next five years you have to suffer the moment of anger you are able to i am not saying suppress your anger that is not what i am talking about please do not suppress any emotion it will come up at a very inappropriate time and you will destroy a lot more deal with it deal with it understand become aware of your anger become aware of the futility of your anger become aware that everybody including you loses many things because of anger burn anger before it burns you so watch out never could be children could be spouse could be parents i mean many a time it is you know it is your tone which creates all the mess could be between a parent and a child it's a tone and anger manifests in an ugly tone ugly tone where there is kindness and compassion the tone itself is uh, different how a mother calls a little child with anger it is a tone the tone has has as has done a great deal of damage in the when there is anger so watch out friends you know when i saw the like just children it is affecting everybody at every stage in life as i always say anger has not changed what you what you become anger angry for has changed anger is not changed you know when you are 5 years old you got angry for a toy 10 years old you got angry for a bicycle 50 or 20 years old you are you are angry for a friend now i don't know what all you are angry for so anger has not changed what you become angry has become as changing now it, if you are not careful it will not leave you you know that's why i said before it burns you burn anger just you know it's has anybody become better because of anger there's an example you know, anger is like holding a ball of fire in your hand and throwing it at another person 
you can you can hurt another person in the process you burnt your hand so watch out watch out and it is uh, it's not worth it